I don't care whose it is, it's still going to be messed up. I'm telling you all, I'm prophesying from the word of God, it's still going to be messed up because this is messed up. And until they get this right, everything they do is going to be out of order. Mm, Jesus, 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 Jesus. So no matter what they come up with, the house is not built by the one that made the divine blueprint in the first place. It is going to fail. It might look good for two or three years, then it's going to fail. I guarantee you it's going to fail. Mm -hmm. Two points of application. We must find God's formula. for the house. We must find God's formula in the house, for the house. God gives us a formula, what the house is supposed to look like. All right. mm -hmm. And we need to do it God's way. All right. That's why we in the church need to vigorously fight against this push for homosexual marriage. Amen. Because there's nothing else in this world that has greater potential to totally discombobulate everything than it is for this idea of homosexual marriage. Those two words don't even go together. Don't get this. Those two words, don't even, they don't even go together because by definition, homosexuality is unnatural. Scientifically, it's unnatural because what's the definition of it being natural? Is that it follows the laws of nature. And so therefore, the laws of nature say in order for you to procreate, you must have the male of the species and the female of the species to get together to, to procreate. And so since two males of the species cannot procreate and two females of the species cannot procreate, therefore, by scientific definition, that relationship is unnatural. That's it. Amen. I'm not being mean. I'm not being homophobic and all that other stuff they want to call us names and all that. That's just raw science. Amen. Okay, okay. So we in the church need to vigorously fight this idea of homosexual marriage. Because what it does is that it tells God his idea, his blueprint for the house was wrong. Mm -hmm. Jesus. And, and, and if we stand back and allow a certain population of people to tell God his blueprint, blueprint was wrong, he is going to hold us responsible. Let me tell y'all this, y'all better do the research. Every country that allows homosexual marriage, what it does is that eventually their economy starts failing. I mean, I mean going down, I mean failing and not recovering. Because what they do is they 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 uh 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 I'm, ma I'm making up a word here. Y'all y'all allow me to make up make up a word. They desanctify the concept of marriage. They're perverting the concept of marriage. Two, 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 two. We must fortify God's formula for the family. We must find God's formula. We find God's formula in the Word of God. We must insist that our families look like the Word of God says they should look. Then we must fortify God's formula by resisting every effort on the part of the enemy to try to reverse God's formula. Okay. Uh, 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 children must be birthed and nurtured by parents. Okay. Uh, uh, God designed uh, 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 parents to, to birth and nurture children. There's a role that each parent plays. Jesus, Jesus, Amen. Jesus. Uh, and God desired children to be raised under the sanctity of a covenant. Okay. Okay. Jesus, Jesus, okay. help me, Holy Ghost. Uh, I'm just, I'm, I, this is what I'm asking that we do. That we learn how to find God's form. And then we fortify, protect, or fight for God's form. For the weapons of this warfare and our calling with the mighty through God to the pulling down of strongholds. Casting down imaginations and every high thing which exalts itself against the knowledge of God, bringing into captivity every thought to the obedience of Jesus Christ. Fight for the family. Oh Jesus, for, oh Jesus, help me, Holy Ghost. Uh, I'm through, y'all. Take me back, take me back, dear Lord. 
to the place